What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 76 video here on the channel. As you can see, I am not on my normal character. This is my main character actually. The one that I play with probably the most. Um, although you probably wouldn't believe it as much because my YouTube character, the one that you guys see in almost every single video, that guy sees a lot of playtime because I'm obviously investing a lot of time for the channel. So he is relatively close in level to this one. This one, I think he's a uh, level 160. Yep, level 160, almost level 161. But uh, I kind of wanted to play with this character mainly because I'm transitioning with my other character into a laser build and I'm already swip, uh, swapping out perk points and stuff. And right now he's pretty freaking weak, so I don't want to really play with him right now uh, until I get that all sorted out. But for now, I'm here at Foundation because there was a recent update that added, uh, I guess, a new mission into this game. Or event, I should say. It's called the Colossal Problem, or a Colossal Problem. And to my understanding, it actually starts here at Foundation. So we're going to be doing that. But just so you guys fully know and uh, uh, full disclosure, of course, this video is probably going to be very short uh, in comparison to some of the other Let's Plays of Fallout 76 because I'm just going to be doing this event. Um, so, yeah, there's that. Uh, if you're excited for this video, do me a huge, huge, huge favor, drop a like for the algorithm on this video, and if you're not already subscribed, please do so, because it really does help this channel grow, so with that being said, let's go ahead and just jump right into this. Alright, so if you guys didn't know, this character, actually, let me show you real quick, he is a sniper, this is my main weapon, I do have other snipers, uh, sniper, you know, weapons that I like, or that I use, but this is mainly the... The, the main one that I use. It's an instigating explosive, uh, you know, sniper rifle with a plus 250 resistance while reloading. I found this in a vendor a long time ago and it's freaking amazing. This, I don't know where the hell I got this man to be honest. Some guy was selling this and this I believe in the same vendor. So I ended up taking them. They were really, really cheap. I don't think anybody freaking wanted them. So there's that. Right now, I used to wear um, he uh, like heavy marine armor. Or uh, excuse me, just marine armor in general. But I'm switching up to heavy, uh, you know, chameleon armor. And I have these three for now. Two of them are just two stars. I'm trying to obviously find the, the right things. I still need a right arm and a right leg. Uh, but those I don't want chameleon, I want them as either lifesavers or, or, uh, well, I want a lifesaver and a auto stim, and then having the three other ones as, of course, chameleon. So there's that. So I think it starts by talking to Maggie Williams, so let's go ahead and talk to her. Hey there. Hi. The name's Maggie. I'm looking for someone to head into Monongah Mine for me. I'll pay for anything you can find about a man named Earl Williams. He's... he... he was my pops. The mines have been closed up since before the war, but... you look like the resourceful type. Think you can lend me a hand? Uh, yeah, for sure. Really? Without hearing any details? Must be real desperate for some caps. But hey... Maybe your desperation will come in handy. I should have asked. <laughs> someone with some real motivation. Crap, I really should have asked. <laughs> hey, How's talk it to going? me. Uh, Do you have a chance to make it to Monaga Mine yet? Uh. You know Penny Hornwright is in Foundation, right? Yeah, I know she's in town. I've been keeping an eye on her. Shame about her face. I guess the Hornwright's ugliness is finally showing up on the outside. I mean, I suppose, but you're kind of cold-hearted. Uh, any ideas on how we can get inside of the Monongah Mine? With all those horrible nukes dropping and destroying everything, you'd think one would land near Monongah Mine. I bet a powerful blast like that would knock the rubble out of the way so you could get inside. I mean, realistically, a blast like that might collapse the entire thing, but hey, let's throw logic out the window, right? Uh, but anyways... Uh, I have, uh, some more questions. Such as? Such as? I want to know more about you. Who are you? Uh, sure. I guess. Uh, are you from Mananga? Yep. Born and raised in that dying mining town. I was glad to leave that shithole. 
<laughs> Especially after what happened to my pops. Uh, why didn't you like living there? The town was full of idiots and cowards. They let Hornwright Industrial walk all over them. As if some corporation was really trying to help us out. They let uh, the Hornwrights take everything from us. Makes sense why Jobs, she doesn't like them. Like her. Hell, even our people. Yeah, it makes sense why she doesn't like, uh, uh, Penny or whatever her name is. So why was Mononga dying exactly? Hornwright Industrial came swooping in like they were our saviors and gave the town a bunch of money for the mining rights. They took away jobs from the miners thanks to their robots, took everything they could from the mine, and then left us high and dry. Damn. All right. So let's talk about something what else. What are you trying to know? Uh, I want to know more about the job. Fair enough. I'll tell you what I can. Uh, how did, how did, uh, Earl, I think is his name, end up in Mona uh, Monaga Mine? He and some other townsfolk got some liquid courage one night and decided to go up to the mine. <sighs> I knew that damn bourbon would be the end of him somehow. They kept going on about getting the last of what they could before that Deke Sachs from Hornwright Industrial closed up the mine. Well... That son of a bitch ended up blasting the entrance closed with everyone still inside. Okay, okay. How did that happen? This was back in January of 76, after Hornwright cleaned out everything that they could from the mine. So, I'm not delusional. I know he's dead. It's been over 20 years, and if the hunger didn't get him, then I'm sure the radiation did. I just, hunger, you say? I hope he didn't suffer too much. Hunger is what leads to Wendigos. But anyways, uh, why didn't anyone uh, try to get him out? You don't think I tried? Oh, damn. I clawed at the rubble until my hands bled, and they had to drag me away. They told me that my pops ran off and said the others left Mananga since there was no more work. I think it was some sort of cover-up. They either got paid off by the Hornwrights to keep quiet, or they didn't want to deal with the expenses of a rescue mission. Okay. Why, why are you saying all that with a smile on your face, though? You're weird. But okay, let's talk about something else, then. Okay. I can tell it's a touchy subject. I don't have all day. Later. Okay. <laughs> all right. Um, look, at Sean. I'm not supposed to go outside of town, but sometimes I do. Shut up, Sean. You're not the real Sean. You're just wearing his clothes, damn it. You're a traitor. All right, but at this point... We basically have to go nuke uh, Monongo Mine, but the thing is, I don't have any nuclear key card, so I have to either A, get one, or B, wait for someone to nuke Monongo Mine. But Meat Week is also going on right now, so there's a good chance that we're going to go do Meat Week first before we go to Monongo Mine. So I'm probably just going to go do that on my own and then wait for a nuke to launch for us to go over there. So. Uh, I'm gonna cut it right here and then just hop on to the point where someone nukes the place and then we'll start from there So let's go. All right guys. So as you can see we just finished uh, the Event right here and right as we were actually beginning this We actually got hit with a nuke and they're nuking the area it appears. Ooh Charlie the Moo Moo outfit nice. So it looks like they're going to be nuking the actual location right there so as soon as the nuke drops we're going to be going over there cuz long story short it's we're basically going to be doing the event I'm actually pretty excited man oh by the way uh I'm right here playing with final render and psycho girl wherever she's at I don't know where she's at. She's around here somewhere. I think Final Render might be leaving though. Uh, but I need this to blow up already so that we can actually take off now. Hold on, let me see. Let me make sure they're not nuking anywhere else. All right. Looks like we got four seconds left. I'm actually pretty excited, dude. Let's go. Alright, looks like the nuke just dropped. 
I'm not gonna be talking uh, to my teammates. There we go. Colossal problem. Nice. Let's go and make our way over there. Time. Meow. Oh, dude, I'm so excited for this. Believe it or not, I actually haven't even found nor fought a Wendigo Colossus, man. So this is going to be my first time fighting the Colossus. So I'm not sure. Whoops, that was an accident. <laughs> All right, so let's just go ahead and follow everybody. I think everyone's going over here in this direction. I'm pretty sure I have a ton of junk in my inventory, but... Oh, well, who cares? Well, that actually, let's see. Uh, junk. I don't have any junk, actually. Why are they going that way? Okay. They just wanted to loot the Wendigo, it looks like. I'm about to say, because it looks like this is the way over here. Oh, fuck! Ah, hide! Dude. Oh, final render left the team. Oh, you know what's probably... He's probably going to switch his character to his higher level character. Probably. I mean, I could be mistaken. So what do we do here? There's literally nowhere to go. I'm not sure. Somebody help me. Assist me, please. <laughs> you, sir. Excuse me, kind citizen. You look pretty cool, actually. And you're a sniper, too. Except you have a combat rifle. That helmet is actually really cool. Is that an atomic shop thing? I'm not sure. If it is, I mean, I'm sure I have it. I literally buy everything from the atomic shop. Wait, I don't think they're, I don't think they're coming. Psyker girl or, uh, or final render. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. I kind of want to just do this anyways. Captain Navy. Hello, God. dude, he's level 423. Yesterday, I believe I saw somebody that was like level 700 and something. It was pretty insane. All right, this is going to be pretty interesting to say the least. I'm a sniper, so I'm... And not not just a sniper, but I use the comp... I, the, uh... The, uh, what is it called? The hunting rifle, so... I'm not sure how much help I'm going to be in this situation. So I'm probably just going to do... Because, I don't know, man. It's going to be crazy. Yeah, see, Psyker Girl left. So they're probably switching servers, potentially. Uh, it's all good. It's not, it's not a big deal. Oh, they actually logged off. So, wait, let me see if they're even still logged in. No, yeah, they switched servers. So I'm guessing they got something else to do. Which is fine. They probably would have, you know, said something if, uh, if I had my mic on. But I don't, so it's all good. Regardless, though, we're going to do this. Is this all that's coming? I feel like we're going to need more than this. I'm kind of nervous. Radiation rumbles going on too. All right. I think this is literally everybody showing up, dude. We have 56 uh, seconds. Good. Strange in numbers. That's actually not too bad. I kind of want to... Whoops. I kind of want to trade the card that I'm using. Um, let's see here. I got seven charisma. What can I, what can I share? I don't think I can share anything. I don't think I can share anything because everything is too high. I have strange in numbers. Um, do I have any other escape artist? I guess. Oh, look, there's a lot of people that are showing up now. Well, kind of. 
like legit dude. What the hell is that? Is this where we're going? Oh, the wall went down. Oh, snap, dude. Ow, that hurt. I missed the other platform. I saw it on the way down. Oh, there he is. Oh my god, dude. I'm not dealing any damage against this guy. He probably has uh, resistances to explosions. Oh my god, bro. Let's hit the head. Maybe. Okay, I need a drink. Oh shit, what is... He's terrified me to death. Rush. <laughs> Alright, go back into sneak mode, because otherwise I'm going to die. Let's go. Well, we're doing pretty decent damage against them. Luckily, I have pretty high sneak. I have escape artist. I have three pieces of chameleon armor with... Uh, it, uh, all of it is shadowed. And not to mention... Oh, God. That sounds scary. What the hell is that? Oh, crap. It's a... Oh, fuck. Run! I need to find some higher spots. Wait, can I go? Can I, can I get up here? Nice. Give me the head. I want the head. All right, let's go ahead and. Is he? Where's he going? I'm not sure. Is there any Wendigos that I can take out from over here? Oh, I just realized this. His name is the name. Oh fuck! Let's go save him. Mate. Mm -mm. Okay. I was gonna do it, but I was scared that the Wendigo Colossus is gonna come and get me. Yeah, his name is Ernie or er, Early Williams. That's the dude that the girl was looking for. I guess it's her, her dad, I think. Let's go. Let's get a critical. Dude, only 178. My damage. Oh, fuck. Let's go get him. Oh, he's got him. He's got him. Oh, that stuff on the ground does... Oh, fuck. It does area of effect damage. Let's go. Get away from me. All right, good. Critical. That does... Oh, fuck, dude. He mutated. I mean, I guess I should have known, seeing as he is a legendary. Sneak, damn it. What the hell's going on right now? There we go. Oh, fuck. Heal. There's so many of them. Oh, I'm not in sneak. Not that it matters. I'm already discovered. Fuck, look at all these guys. Is this normal? Thank God for a bloody mess. That killed most of them. All right, where's... Er oh, fuck. I was about to say, where's early Williams, but... Clearly, he already found me. Alright, let's go up here. Yeah, dude, look at that. He does some area of effect damage. Ow. Would somebody be able to heal me? Since I'm up here? I hope so. Somebody assist me, por favor. Revenant is dead. And I have nine seconds. Is anybody even shooting him? Alright, well, I'm dead. Alright. Well, the guy, I'm pretty sure, was on his way to save me, but... It was too late. Where do we go? Uh... Oh, yeah, right here. Let's go. Alright, straight. And then there was another platform on the left. And then go down here. Oh, God. Let's go. Let's get some headshots. The headshots seem to do the most damage by far. 
I mean, I thought that was pretty obvious, but oh fuck. I'm scared. Is he gonna do the screaming thing? Um, I guess not. Oh fuck, this guy right here. Die! What? He didn't die? Alright, he's dead now. Oh, hello. Nice to see you, early Williams. Oh, dude. He, each one of his heads does something different. Screeching head. So, can we potentially destroy him? Or, uh, like, eliminate his ability to do that if we destroy his head? I don't know. It's got a lot of health, it looks like, though. Let's go. 341. That's a lot of damage. Against him, specifically. Where'd he go? How many Wendigos are here? That's insane, dude. Look at that. 1,900 damage. You! Stop shooting my friends! I should definitely modify a combat rifle. Probably like an anti-armor or something. Actually, I have, now that I think about it, I have a, uh, an anti-armor, uh, what is it called? Fixer. I totally forgot I had it, to be honest. Oh, fuck. Heal! That was close, dude. Oh, no. Oh, I could move around a little bit. Let's go. I think he has uh, resistances to fire. I mean, to uh, explosives. What the hell's going on? Run! I gotta take that dude out. Oh god, dude. This dude is a lot harder than I expected. Let's go. The screeching head is almost done. You're not gonna get me this time, buddy. Damn, dude, that didn't do anything. He kicks too? What the hell doesn't this guy do? Oh god, get away from me, please. Oh, I'm running right to him. Run away. Oh god, I ran in straight into that area of effect thing. Where is he? Oh, he's right there. Dude, I think... I think we took out his head. Too bad his head doesn't actually fall off, though. So, let's see. This is the moment of truth. I guess we're gonna find out if... Crippling his head... Destroys his ability to do that. Alright, so that's done. Alright, so all of his heads are done. Oh, fuck. Get away from me, sir. I don't appreciate. Alright, so. Crippling his head. Does not. That was close. Oh, shit. I'm gonna die. Crippling his head does not eliminate his ability to. Do those moves. Come on, baby. We got this, guys. There's only a handful of us in here. Oh, no. Stop kicking me! I'm dead. Oh, we're... Oh, fuck. I saw the freaking health too late. I was about to heal, but it was too late, like I said. The good thing is that... I think we have enough time. We have 15 more minutes left, and we already had, uh, mutated, so we should be good. We should be able to take him out. All right, I'm actually going to go into sneak early. And use a right away. Where's homeboy? Come on, buddy. I should have used my fixer, man. I feel like the fixer would have been perfect for this guy. Come on, buddy. Oh, God. I'm, I'm actually nervous, dude. 
This dude is pretty strong. Tanky, I mean. Get away from me! Oh god, I'm stuck. Run! Oh, what the hell am I doing? There we go. Oh my god, they're all coming back. Let's go. Look at all these guys, dude. If I take these guys out, at least the other guys would be able to... Focus on early Williams. Let's go. Because I do the most damage to this guy, like, by far. Let's go. Dunskies. So where's homeboy at? Oh, dude, he's almost dead. Let's go. Come on, baby. Get away from me, please. You're so rude. Super rude. Look at him. He's chasing me like he owns me. Oh, God. Get away from me. All right, we got him. He's done, skis, bro. He got, we got him. Did we get anything out of it? Yeah, I don't want that. Uh. Yeah, I guess that's it. I don't really want anything else right now. Oh, escape the tunnel. How do you escape the tunnel? Oh god. How do I escape the tunnel? This, does this open up? It doesn't. Oh, this way. I can see the guys running away. Let's go. Run. For Narnia. Oh fuck, dude. And we're getting chased by Wendigos. Yeah, this is dangerous as hell. Oh, God. Run! Oh, fuck, dude. There's so many of them, dude. Oh, this is where we began our quest. We have one minute left. I think we should be fine. Run for it! We should be fine. I think we're good. Oh, God. That almost smashed me. Run! We're here. We're out of here, right? We're here. Ooh, box. I'll take that. Nah. Nah. Yep. All right, let's go. Run! I was about to say, why can't I get out? Wait a minute, I just realized this. They nuked this place. I pro- I, Luckily, I have a hazmat suit inside my inventory, so... There's that. If it decides to load, that is. That was actually pretty freaking cool, dude. I feel like we would have done way better had I had my anti-armor fixer, dude. I have that in my freaking box, dude. I totally forgot to take it out. It would have been perfect. Okay, so I need to throw on... My hazmat suit, like, now. Dude, that was insane. Alright, so I'm encumbered, and I don't want this, so I'm just gonna drop it. What was it? Um. Wait, what is this? My right arm. So this, I'm dropping. Do I have? I think... Alright, whatever. Let's see what we get. Any day now. Okay, so we got some flux. Wendigo Colossus skin. I think I might have bought that from a vendor. Let me see. Uh, plans. Yeah, I ended up buying that from a vendor. Oh, well. 
I guess I could have got it for free from here. It is what it is. Let's go ahead and get the hell out of here before we end up dying. So let's go back to my house. What? I'm still encumbered? What else do I have? Uh, okay, we'll drop that. We'll drop the three meat cleavers. I'm actually pretty encumbered, actually. Didn't we get the Chali the Moo Moo? Oh, there it is. That's actually really cool. Those, I saw people wearing that at, uh, during meat week. Uh, Alright, let's eat some food, I suppose. Actually, we're good. Also, I can switch up my clothes. Alright, let's put that stuff on. That should be everything. My Under Armour, my bandana. Where's my glasses? There we go. Back to normal, I think. Hold on, let's find out. Yeah, I just need a right leg. Alright, let's throw that back on. Let's go back to camp. Now that we're no longer encumbered. Let's go. That was actually a pretty freaking awesome event. Like, I really, really enjoyed it. So, is there an update to this... Mission? Because I know we were on a mission. Or did it... Auto-update? We probably have to go... And talk to the girl again, huh? We should have probably went... To... Uh... What is it called? The place... Uh, uh, I forgot what the hell's called. Return to Maggie. I didn't even have this freaking activated. All right, so Maggie is literally over there in Foundation. So we're going to Foundation. Luckily, it's not too far from our camp, so we don't have to spend a lot of money on fast traveling. So let's go ahead and see what she has to say now that we found... Uh, Mr. Williams, I think she said it was her father, and unfortunately we ended up taking him out. I think that's probably what she would want, though, to be honest, if she had known his fate. I don't know. Let's see what she says. She's probably going to be upset. Alright, let's go. And now I'm the team leader. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to whatever her name is, though. Maggie. I knew you could. Uh, thank you? I'm so glad to be away from the pit. I saw Hello. a glass go down near Monanga. What'd you find? Uh, your dad? Uh... Uh, I found the watch, but your father turned into a man-eating monster. I'm not going to lie oh to her. God, I, I can't believe it. Pops didn't deserve that sort of fate. No one does. To think they had to resort to eating each other. All thanks to those damn horn rights. I'm, I'm glad you were able to put him to rest. He'll always be the man in this picture to me. Aw. We got... Was that gold bullion? Let's see what rewards we get from this. Also, is this repeatable oh, or is this a one time off? Nervous. Is it not gonna tell me what rewards I get? I guess not. It doesn't love me. The game does not love me. Uh, did we get any weapons? Any outfits? No. I mean, I'll take some food and some water. Quicker you recover, I'm missing a quick. I think we're good, actually. So that's it. Let's go home real quick. I kind of want to show you that uh, that fixer that I have. I have a bunch of stuff that I've bought from you know vendors and stuff. The fixer, I actually believe it or not, I actually got it from the purveyor. 
or did I get it from the purveyor? I can't remember, dude. I have so much legendary stuff, it's not even funny. I'm pretty sure I got my fixer from the purveyor, though. It's super freaking OP, dude. I love it so much. And since this is a stealth sniper, it actually, it's actually pretty freaking amazing. All right, check it out. This is my camp for my main character. All right, looks nice, huh? Hold on, let me show you that fixer, though. Uh, right here. Anti-armor the fixer. Improved stealth, faster sneak movement speed, 25 faster fire rate. Ignores 50% of your target's armor. That's the anti-armor, of course, and plus one agility. I think this thing is pretty freaking amazing, if I do say so myself. What is this? this I wanted for my other character. I bought this from a vendor, and it's... I, I think I, I called it the dragon elf. <laughs> uh, look at all this stuff, dude. I have a bunch of cool stuff. This, I bought it for my uh, other character, too. I'm just not sure if I'm going to use it, though, because I, I don't... I don't, I'm not sure if I like the effects. Like, Furious is cool. Fire Rate's cool. But 25, uh, 250 damage resistance while reloading is just whatever, you know? Um, these are some of my backup weapons. This, I still need to find uh, a bunch of mods for it so I can actually modify it. To my liking of course uh this has been my one of my primaries for a while i swap off How between weapons and i love this thing right here i love this thing so this much toilet paper. this i have it just because it's cool and i have it modified the enclave plasma rifle i just can't shake these nightmares two shot radium this rifle i want this for my other character too it's a two shot faster f uh reload it's just all right i guess I'm sure I can find something else, but that I kind of wanted for my PvP area. So this is my camp. Just gonna do a quick sweep of the camp. This is the living area, obviously. This is the vending area, and then of course there this is are. where Commander, whatever right. Sophia is. Always puts a smile on my face. And this is the crafting area is on the roof. Let's go ahead and store. Oh, I don't have anything. All right, let's go back downstairs. And, alright guys, we're gonna go ahead and call it a video right here, right now. I know this is a little bit shorter than normal. I kind of, I just wanted to do the Colossal Problem. And we kind of had like a little surprise guest of the final render here in the beginning of the video. But I guess he had to go do something else, so I don't know. That's cool, regardless. So, if you enjoyed this video though, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. Because it really does help this channel grow. So, with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces. <laughs>